Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new to this channel, my name is Amra and this is Amra's Beauty Blog. I'm a freelance makeup artist with a passion for all things beauty. If you're a subscriber, then a welcome return. If you like this video, then please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell for weekly uploads. So today I'm gonna to be talking about Coach and this is the Pillow Tabby Shoulder Bag in the size 18, which is the smaller mini size. I decided to purchase this because I am a lover of handbags, as you probably know. I've done a couple of videos on handbags, but also because I have been falling in love with crossbody bags and I am a massive Coach fan because I think that their bags are so well made they're affordable and I use their bags more regularly than any of my bags alongside my Longchamp bags, I'd say. They are the most frequently used. I have the Hayden bag, which you would have seen a previous video on. I have the 101 Dalmatian limited edition bag that you would have seen as well. The Pillow Tabby reimagines the structured silhouette of an archival 1970s coach design with plush ultra soft leather and wrapped signature hardware. Smaller than our beloved Tabby shoulder bag 26, the Petite 18 features two detachable straps to carry by hand, style as a shoulder bag or wear crossbody. So this comes in a number of colors and there are some permanent colors on the website there are showing up as eight colors and I decided to go with this sort of darker pink color and I was umming and ahhing about this because I have a lot of pink handbags and I hopefully will be doing a video soon about my love of these pink handbags but I have different shades of pink and when I saw the lighter pink I thought oh this looks quite nice but then I saw this darker one and I've noticed that a lot of other people have purchased this color over the lighter one and that didn't influence my decision but it made me realize that the darker pink is going to be something that I can use more often than the lighter pink which although is very pretty it didn't seem to do much for my skin tone when I put it on in the shop I decided to go with the darker shade because I think that it just complemented my lifestyle a bit better it's got the gold hardware the color that I picked up was in brass rouge but the color that I was contemplating was in the color candy pink. And as much as I do love pink and it is a beautiful pink, it just didn't really do much for me, it kind of washed me out. So I'm gonna attach some pictures so you can see how it looked when I was in store. And I'm going to show you what this bag is like. It's Nappa leather, inside it's multi-function pockets, snap closure, fabric lining, detachable handle with a four inch drop, detachable long strap with a 21 and a half inch drop for shoulder or crossbody wear. Yeah, it is so lovely. And I've seen a lot of videos on YouTube because this bag has really taken off. And I think Coach have really sort of understood the market and have come out with a bag that is affordable, but yet functional and in a really good price point. So it comes in the Coach bag, which protects it. This is the bag and it is so so cute i don't have any sort of soft tight bags and this actually does feel like a pillow i would sleep on it if i could but it feels absolutely gorgeous it is in the gold hardware or brass hardware so it gives it that extra classic classy kind of look and you've got the coach logo here you've got the brass all the way around then the two sides are for hanging the straps on so you get this strap which is for the crossbody section you also get a strap which looks like this so i will show you how the attachments work as well it is really really lovely so you put on initially the first two sides so i'll show you how this looks it's Nappa leather, so it feels extraordinarily soft. So let me show you how this looks. So you've got this mini hook, so you can wear it in the crook of your arm. You can hold it like this. There's just so many different ways. I don't think you can put it on your arm. It's just not that sort of type of sort of size, but it's just nice that you can alternatively hold it like this as well. Let me show you the detail of the bag. It is a gorgeous. It feels very, very soft. When you open it, I will just show you, you've got this closure which is kind of magnetic and clicks into place. When you open it up, it's really lovely inside. So you have an inner pocket, which is here. You have a pocket which is here. And then you've got a front pocket, which is here. Now I am someone who, when I go out nowadays, I don't like to carry too much with me. But what I will show you is what it does fit. I have my mobile 
So I'm just going to show you that from the side, and this is my Pat McGrath cover. It fits perfectly. So you can see on the back pocket I put my mobile, but alternatively you could put that on the front pocket as well. You can fit a card holder, so I'll show you that now. But I've got a LV holder where you can put cards in. So imagine that I have some cards in here. I'm literally gonna put it at the front pocket. That's where I would put my cards. I'm just gonna put the MAC lipstick in there. So that fits perfectly. So on a night out, I mean, you're not gonna need a lot, but at least you've got your underground pass or your cards that you can put in here in your card holder. And that can go there. You've got your mobile and you've got your lippy that can go in here. I think you could fit something else in, definitely possibility, but I just wanted to show you so far what I have. Um, alternatively, if you wanted to just carry coins, you could take this out. I've also got an LV coin holder, which I'm just gonna test it out. It still fits. I mean, even though it's slightly bigger than the bag, it does close still. Technically, you could put change in there as well. So that does fit. So I just wanted to show you what fits inside. You close it um, and then you've literally got everything in there. So I'm just gonna show you what it looks like with the long strap on. So basically you attach the strap to this bit here, which you have on this side. And then on this side, you attach the strap again. And then I just wanted to show you what it looks like on. So you pretty much have that. I'm five foot two and it sits just on my hip. It's a perfect, perfect length for me because I'm five foot two. Um, and I absolutely love it. It's so, so pretty. The color is gorgeous and I absolutely love it. So I just wanted to show you how that looks and how easy it is. You can also get a strap that you can put on. So to conclude, I just wanted to say that I love this bag so, so much. I love the fact that it's really, really soft. I used to have a mulberry bag that was made of Nappa leather and I find that Nappa is just so lovely and soft. Now, the only thing with Nappa is it can scratch quite easily, a bit like lambskin, I would say. It's fully leather and so reasonably priced. I am thinking at some point I might try and get the larger tabby. Sometimes I want to take more than just my phone and my wallet, but I will look into that at some point. But for now, this color and this style suits my lifestyle and it's perfect. I have fallen in love with Coach again and I can't wait to try more styles. But for now, this is the style that I wanted to show you and the color and I really hoped you liked my review. Please don't forget to leave your comments in the comment section below. Do you have a coach bag? What bag do you have from coach? Let me know, I'd love to hear and why you love coach if you do. If you don't, I'd like to sort of hear as well, like it'd be good to understand. It's great to hear because everybody has different ideas of bags and what they like, what they don't like and for what reason. So I'd love to hear. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell and I will see you in my next video. Thank you.